from the Sony Pictures Studios, this is Jeopardy! Welcome to another game of Jeopardy! Let's see what the categories are for this first round of play. Etiquette. Inventors. Business and industry. Songs. Familiar phrases. Religion. Go ahead, player one. A person with a hidden flaw is said to have feet of this from a dream image in Daniel chapter 2, verse 33. Player 3. Exactly. All right, player three. Many aquatic animals swim open mouthed and appear to drink constantly. Hence the phrase, to drink like one of these animals. Player one. You are correct. That puts you in the lead. Okay, contestant one. The depressing expression, down in these, is probably derived from a Middle Dutch word for haze. Player one. Correct. All right, pick again. Akin to caught in the act, to be caught this way alludes to a murderer smeared with blood. Player one. That's it, exactly. All right, pick again. If you're out of favor, you're in this pet residence. Player one. Yes, indeed. All right, pick again. In 1959, Hank Ballard and the Midnighters introduced this song that Chubby Checker later took to number one. Player three. Correct. What will it be, player three? Who could ask for anything more? A line from this song was the title of Ethel Merman's autobiography. Player two. That's it, exactly. Player two, it's your turn. Lawrence Hammond invented an electric type of this musical instrument. Player one. Oh, I'm sorry, that's wrong. Player two. That's wrong. Anyone? Player two, it's your turn. On rainy days, be especially careful not to poke other people with the point of this device. Player one. Yes, indeed. 
Layer one, it's your turn. This song from High Society begins, I give to you and you give to me. Layer two. No, too bad. Player one, your turn. He frolicked in the autumn mist in a land called Hanali. Player three. Correct. What will it be, player three? In 1935, John Tyson bought 500 of these creatures in Arkansas and sold them for a profit in Chicago. Player two. That's it, exactly. Player two, what'll it be? This company stressed the durability of its appliances with its Lonely Repairman ad campaign. Player three. You are correct. Your choice, player three. The person who is archbishop of this is the primate of all England. Player two. You are correct. Player two, it's your turn. Statues of foxes are found at the Enar shrines of this Japanese religion. Player two? That's wrong. Anyone? Here is the correct response. Okay, player. This company's roots date back to the Anglo-Swiss Condensed Milk Company, founded in 1866. Player three. Why, yes. All right, player three. In 1941, Delta Airlines moved its headquarters from Monroe, Louisiana, to this city. Player three. Correct. All right, pick again. In 1958, Jack Kilby invented the integrated circuit for this Dallas electronics firm. Player two. Correct. What'll it be, player two? In Haitian folk belief, it's a soulless corpse reanimated by a boker or voodoo priest. Player one. You are correct. Player one, it's your turn. The theme from Love Story is also known by this title, the first four words of the song. Player two. Correct. Player two, it's your turn. He invented a razor with disposable blades after experts at MIT told him it was impossible. Player two? That's it, exactly. All right, pick again. Thomas Hancock patented vulcanized rubber in England the year before this man in the U.S. Player two? Yes, indeed. All right, pick again. Before designing the first successful steamboat, he worked as a portrait painter. Player three. Correct. Player three, you choose. Obituaries often state that a contribution may be made to a charity in lieu of these. Player one. You are correct. 
Your choice, player one. If you see an adult wearing a bib in a restaurant, he's probably eating this large crustacean. Player one. Correct. All right, pick again. In a wedding party, it's the male equivalent of the maid of honor. Player one. Why, yes. All right, pick again. Answer. Early double. Player one, please make your wager. At a formal dinner, this should hang down about 18 inches. It should not reach the floor. Player one. No. Here is the correct response. All right, pick again. If, as some say, General Han Sin invented this circa 200 B.C., he was the first to tell someone to go fly one. Player three. That's it. Player three, what'll it be? In this religion, the god Shiva is often depicted as Nataraja, the cosmic dancer. Player two. That's right. And to finish the board. In 1739, this Methodist wrote in his journal, I look upon all the world as my parish. Player three. That's right. All right, that's the end of the Jeopardy round. Let's look at the total scores so far. Let's move on to double jump. Now here are the categories for the double jeopardy. Ranks and titles. Children's literature. World religions. Mythology, colors, movie debuts. Start us off, player one.
He made his big screen debut in He Knows You're Alone, which would probably scare Forrest Gump. Player two. You are correct. It's your turn, player two. Born Alicia Foster, she made her movie debut as a child in the film Napoleon and Samantha. Player two. Yes. All right, pick again. The 1980 college comedy Midnight Madness marked the film debut of this Back to the Future star. Player one. You are correct. Player one, what'll it This title character went ape for Jessica Lange in her first film in 1976. Player one. That's it. All right, pick again. The answer is a video game double. Player one, please make your wish. She played a nurse in the 1976 film A Matter of Time, which starred her mother, Ingrid Bergman. Take a look at your monitor. Player one. Yes. All right, pick again. Mandarin and Tangerine are shades of this. Player one. That's it, exactly. All right, pick again. It means to cover up wrongdoings, or a mixture to brighten up a fence. Player three. Why, yes. What will it be, player three? The Jewish Sabbath begins at sunset on this day. Player three, it's your turn. Nickname for U.S. currency from the color on the reverse. Player two. To be sure. Okay, player two. It's the feminine version of the address, Milord. Player one. That's right. It's your turn, player one. Often used to describe a hair color, the name of this lustrous shade of black is a bird, too. Player two. That's it, exactly. Your choice, player two.
His Kidnapped was first published as a serial in Young Folks magazine. Anybody? Okay, player two. Shade of paint you need for most of the exposed areas on the USS Missouri. Player three. That's right. All right, player three. In Norse myth, sisters known as the Norns represent the past, present, and this. Player one. To be sure. What'll it be, player one? The Arabian wilderness was home to this bird that was reborn from its own ashes. Player one. That's it. That takes you into second place. All right, pick again. Answer. Really Player one, please make your wager. With Athena's help, Apius built this object in which the Greeks hid. Player one. To be sure. All right, pick again. Orthrus, a two-headed dog who guarded the cattle of Geryon, was the brother of this Hades hound. Player one. To be sure. All right, pick again. The winged horse Pegasus arose from the blood of this Gorgon when Perseus cut off her head. All right, pick again. Gandhi said, Hinduism will live so long as there are Hindus to protect this animal. Player one. Mm, regrettably, no. Player three. Right you are. All right, player three. His enlightenment has been dated to around 528 B.C., after a seven-week stay under the Bodhi. Player two. That's it. All right, contestant two. Meaning first in position or rank, it's a synonym for prime minister. Player three. No, too bad. Here is the correct response. Your choice, player two. Welch is the real name of this spy in a 1964 novel by Louise Fitzhugh. Player three. That's right. Contestant three, it's your turn. He dedicated Now We Are Six to Christopher Robin's best friend, Anne Darlington. 
Contestant three, it's your turn. Political title given the head of the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints. Player two. You are correct. Player two, it's your turn. According to the First Vatican Council, when the Pope speaks this way, he's infallible. Anybody? Here is the correct response. Player two. A hetman, or ataman, was the leader of a village of these Russian horsemen. Player two. Exactly. All right, pick again. From 1867 to 1914, this country had a Khedive as its Khehed. Player two. That's wrong. Anybody? All right, pick again. You'll find a verger in a church and a shamus in one of these. Player two. That's right. All right, pick again. This Mary Mapes Dodge novel contains the story of a boy who thrust his finger into a hole in a dike. Player three. I'm sorry, that's incorrect. And to finish the board... Green Grass of Wyoming was the second sequel to this novel about Ken McLaughlin and his half-wild filly. Anyone? That's the end of Double Jeopardy. Let's take a look at the scores. Take a look at the category for Final Jeopardy. Authors. Player three, could we have your wager, please? Player two, your wager, please. Player one, please make your wager. Here's the Final Jeopardy answer. Let's see how everyone did. Thanks, Johnny. Player three, your question? That's right. And your wager was? <laughs> Player two, your question? Oh, sorry, that's incorrect. Let's see how much it cost. Oh, I guess it's just not your day. Player one, let's take a look at your question. That's right. And your wager was? That puts you in the lead. Congratulations, Player One. You're the Jeopardy champion. Thanks for playing Jeopardy. Hope you had a good time. 
So long, everybody.